going on? I'm just waiting for a mate. Ow, D. Scraping the shin. Not a way to start your evening. Ice. I need to do a Minecraft stream, Ezekiel, you say. On Friday. Oh, let's go to the right screen. Here we go. Bed war with the fans. Quite keen to do a... Uh, a, a bit of a Minecraft stream. Quite keen indeed. So, um, yeah, ice, ice, baby. It's the way to do it. What's the do 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 part from, though, Ezekiel? Is it just me, or are we all getting a few little bits across the screen? Come on, you. Sort your game out. The beats after the ice. Ah, do 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 do. All right, got it. JoJo's Bizarre Adventures. <laughs> I don't. I don't quite get that one. But that's not surprising. Are we? Are we all getting uh, these little lines across on the screen every so often, just flashing on and off? Or is that just me? That's annoying me. Yeah, it is happening. All right. I did have an emergency thing set up. It's annoying me. It's annoying me sufficiently to do something about it. I, uh, we've got some really cool things uh, up. Hey, Keo, how you going? Um, uh, which I managed to pick up today. Ooh, pick up. We're going to post some photos on our Discord. Uh, and we're going to... I've got to do some rearranging first before I do any more announcements on that one. Um, but it is very, very cool for the stream and I'm very excited about it. Where did I put that bit? Where is it? see it right now oh well i will wait with that part some stuff fell over oh wow we're going for full chat karaoke today full chat karaoke in the in the house everyone's wednesday must be going well mine has gone quite well indeed chat quite well indeed uh you're gonna start Carry the chain. <laughs> My God. Oh well. Well, while Ezekiel gets uh, karaoke going in the uh, in the chat, uh, what we're going to be doing, chat, we got um, yes, last no Monday. God, I, mean, I was going to say last week, we pulled the Manaphy from the uh, Shining Fates tin, the little Shining Fates tin that we opened up, and um, we kind of got inspired by it. And uh, so we've done our little mock-up of what we'd like to create. Um, yeah, this, uh, it's a little bit rough, but, you know, that's what these mock-ups are for. So what we're going to do is uh, we'll be cutting 
the picture of our Manaphy out of the main card. We're going to keep that, and that's going to be um, like a table fold in the middle of our card here. And um, then we're just going to get these wave textures. These were my badly drawn wave textures. I just wanted something a bit stylized to go that way. Um, and then we're going to have a go at uh, creating these kind of glowy tendrils. Glowy tendrils, which... Um, yeah, we're going to see how we can actually do these. I really would like to get these kind of as a translucent layer above the cards. So we're going to have a go at that. That's probably going to be a job for Thursday, my feeling is. My aim is to get all the base kind of stuff together uh, for our stream tonight. And uh, <laughs> this is some amazing chat. <laughs> and our idea is to get all the base stuff done tonight. Uh, and so that we're ready for kind of final construction by the end of our stream on Thursday. Um, how are we finding the brightness on this one, chat? Is it bright enough or is it over... Is it slightly over flared? Maybe I just need to adjust the... Bring that down a little bit. How's that? Is that a little bit better? I like that one. All right, a little bit of shadow. We're going to work on that one. With, we, we might get to work on it ooh, later in this week. Chat. Maybe that's a hint as some stuff that we're going to be doing. So, um, yeah. So we had a heart attack uh, just before the stream. Uh, that no, uh, we uh, we lost the manaphy. So uh, we found it again, chat, so we're good. So we managed to uh, find our Manaphy, so we're all happy once again. Just realized this one here, have I done it around the wrong way? Hold on. Click that, edit. Manaphy should be around the other way, really, shouldn't it? Hold on. Flip that way. Yeah, that's better. Why did the lettering have to be backwards? That's a bit better. How's that? There we go. All right, technical. Technical. Beautiful. Right, that's much better. So this is that's our plan of attack. So um, yeah, without further ado, we're gonna get into it. Remember, we've got um, some packs of battle stars to open at the end uh, of our stream. Uh, this will be added as people donate and sub um, subscribe and follow we're just kind of cool things to do and they'll inspire us for future kind of uh, future shows as well so yeah that's our plan of attack and so our job today is to get all of this stuff uh, ready for being put together so um, I went out and I got myself Ezekiel was just really going to town. Really going to town. We went out and we got ourselves some nice little blues. Lots of little blues here, chat. So, we got a bit of stuff to choose from. Um, what I'm looking at doing is kind of doubling. I think so we're gonna do probably like a more of a textural one and then something a bit more free-flowing is kind of what we're after so um, as I went through some of these I was kind of a bit 50 50 kind of just trying to see uh, what ones would match ha ah, excellent forget to plug in What a rookie streamer, forgetting to plug his stuff in. Um, I can't even interact with this stuff, D. My God. So, yeah, we're looking at a background 
and then like a foreground one to go underneath our card. Um, I'm thinking slightly darker for the background part and then maybe lighter as we get towards the card. So, um, so this part here I was thinking darker and then maybe a lighter texture maybe just to see if that kind of will contrast nice against the the card itself so for my darker ones what I have let's have a look here kind of got these three um, that's the way D, keep it going. So these are our three kind of choices. So, got like just the patterned, pattern type one, a uh, bit of the seashells and, um, I was going to say Omanite, but it's, uh, Nautilus. The starfish and the little anchors on that one. So those are the ones we we're looking at maybe for our little backgroundy. We could, if we wanted to be a little bit different, we could go for something like this, which actually could work. Like a bit of a textured pattern like this. I don't know. What's kind of anything standing out for people there in chat? As much as their the karaoke is going. Any of these ones calling out to you in terms of the backing for the main part of our card. I tried having a look at just some planes, but I'm really unhappy kind of with the blues that I've found. These ones here are just a little bit too a little bit too basic. Yeah, the compass one is kind of nice. I'm thinking maybe if we go for the compass and then we go... Because that's quite linear and textured. And then... Okay, so say if we went down that track, right? Or the anchor. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm kind of with you on those ones, D. Thinking those two, probably. And then for the splash itself, we don't actually have to be literal. Like I got this one because it's, um, you know, water. <laughs> this kind of the thing of the the theme of the theme of the card, and and that it will be that kind of moving kind of splash kind of effect. Um, and it does kind of break against nicely against the both the grid and that. Um, that one again, we wouldn't use that one if we were doing the anchor. I think that's kind of a bit too samey samey. Got to get your charger. Go for that D. Actually, quite like. Actually, these two might be better. this too with the texture I quite like this it's not a bad one so using um, so using that as the background and then this is our swirl kind of pattern using that I quite like this one here because it does go darker so it does it pushes the card to the foreground so that pushes pushes what we want to you know the manaphy part of it it's quite similar on this part this does have some nicer blues that kind of echo the manaphy a little bit more Yeah. Kind of 
kind of leaning away from the anchor. And I'd prefer this kind of texture. Hmm. Kind of looks alright. It's starting to look a bit more. Bring that down. So that's our background. We just slice, slice through here as our main half. Don't really need the the northeast southwest part. Although I can cut it this way, and we can just see. Let's actually do that part and just see kind of what what we feel if it's going to work for us. So with this one, uh, what are we at? This one should be 29.7, but we'll just check. Yep, 29.7. So uh, we're gonna chop that in the two. in English. Oh, why do I know that one? So, if we use the compass on this one, I kind of like the subtlety of the kind of the white one here, rather than just, that's just a bit in your face for my liking. It's a little bit in my face. Yeah, this one feels nicer. I quite like this one here. I think that's going to be our backing. I like that. This one here, mm, yeah. It would be hidden a bit. Like, we can hide it by doing that. Hey Cam, how are we doing? How is your day going? We're just trying to decide on the backing card for our one here. So the choices that we have, they're both the same pattern, but we've got this kind of um, shadowed, like, white uh, watermark, as opposed to, like, the solid compass. I kind of like the watermark as opposed to the solid compass. Can you guys see that? So, because what we're going to have is, even though a lot of the uh, splash is going to be covering it a lot of the splash will be covering this part just feel this is a little bit thing i'm good uh i umpired tonight but school was rubbish excellent i'm stoked that you umpired tonight that was cool was that doing uh the intermediate level stuff cam or was that uh doing college level or were you still doing pro are you doing primary uh umpiring Hmm, I think I'm leaning this way. I like that. It's kind of, I don't know, it's gonna provide a nice little texture for us. We will use that at some point. There'll be some other water type Pokemon that will like to use that one. Um, I went to uh, the Ytac Music and Arts thingy today. Ooh, Ezekiel, cool. So is that like a, is a taster kind of thing to see what their program is like? That's awesome. Yes, four rounds of intermediate umpiring. 
Oh, wow. Well done, Cam. Hey, and that's good. Money in the back pocket. Love that. Super duper fun. That's cool. So what's um what's your thing, Ezekiel? Are you looking at the the music or the art side of it or both? What's your what's your kind of um deal? Alright, we've got that one chat. So now we're gonna have a look and I feel the choices are between these guys. And because I've got this texture here, I don't know if I want to use... This one here has got a nice little texture on this side. Um, we did drama, choreography, and dance as our samples. Nice. So dance, a uh, drama and dance, are they kind of areas that you want to get into? Or is it... Um, yeah, so the arts rather than fine arts. Is kind of what you're looking at. Oh, not really. Okay. So, are you into the fine arts? So, you know, painting, sculpting, or something like that. The teams did really well, though. Oh, that's cool. Um, but it depends, because I might go to Henderson High. Oh, well, there we go. Hey, Chunky! Welcome, welcome. How are you doing? I am being my usual, slightly indecisive self while choosing some patterns before we do our final card. I really like the contrast here, chat. This is kind of subtle. This one here. Should be kind of cool. Using that, just take that away. Um, had a ball thrown right at my face and might have ended up with a black eye, but hey. Excellent. It, well, well, it wouldn't be a netball game, Cam, if you didn't get injured. Henderson High is great. Are you writing that? Um, Cam can be writing that with a little bit of cynicism. But in general, they, they, they actually do have a very good arts program. I do know, I, I know that. In fact, the music teacher that is there used to... Um, oh, actually might not be there at the moment. Uh, used to be the uh, music teacher at our school at my at my current school at Henderson Intermediate so there we go I quite like that part of it if we flipped it you kind of got a bit more of the greens the sea greens in that one hmm this is that darker end Yeah. Let's check it with this other one. The arts program is amazing. Uh, I don't even know who the music teacher is. <laughs> there we go. This is kind of nice. I quite like this one. Got that kind of contrast there. It's kind of reaching. Although we're not using the ocean, are we? But it does. I don't know, it echoes this part, like the ocean part. We're going to cut this out, and we're going to cut this out of the Manaphy. Um, which is, so the Manaphy is going to be a bit more floating. But that kind of echoes that, kind of that ocean part there. Hmm. Like art is a good thing at the school. Nice. That's good to hear. Art was always my favorite. One of my favorite subjects. I always had fantastic teachers in that um, area. That and graphic design. Well, in my day, it was called technical drawing. Um, and loved uh, what they did in that one. All right. Let's cut this uh, into A5. This will give us a bit more of a clear idea, chat. I don't know if my tummy was gurgling. I don't know if the microphone picked up my gurgle on the cam on the microphone right then. All right. How's that looking, chat? I quite like that. 
quite nice, eh? My laptop, uh, before going into mod view, as quiet as a minifan, my laptop at the moment I go into mod, airplane mode activated, prepare for takeoff. Yeah, well done. Uh, gotta love running uh, extra things on the PC. I'm looking at my one, my one's running at about 78%. I don't actually, does it, I, I don't know, does my one, I don't even know if my one, does it pick up any, there's a, a, a small amount of noise from mine, but I don't know if that gets picked up on camera or on the mic. What do we reckon, Chad? I quite like that. That's kind of looking the business there. A little bit of flair on the card there. How's that? I quite like that contrasting there. My Chrome is using 22%. That, that Actually, that's true. Chrome does that, doesn't it? When you have tabs open, Chrome is is absolutely uh, hungry, isn't it? Maybe I should just, because at the moment I do run my streamer dashboard in the background. Um, and my goodness, my gut is rumbling. So I do have that kind of running just there. Um, yeah, but who knows? Oh, we'll go for that. Right, chat, I think this is good. All right, so we're going to try cover, be a bit wispy. All right, so we're going to do, get our water pattern down. We're going to cut Manaphy out. We're going to have that centered frame lifted. Um, I got for myself. And I cannot lay my eye on it. There it is. Got myself a little bit of um, some plastic. So this is going always good to do uh, some nice plastic parts that you can't quite see. There you go. So that is going to be the layer that we're going to try do our pink wisps. All right, the magic, this this stuff on. Um, uh, I've been thinking about just the ways to do it because I just don't like. I was looking at the paper today, and this was the paper that I got. It just, it really just doesn't have that glow that I want. But whether I'm overthinking it, and maybe I just need to, because it is basically white with a pink glow. So maybe I need to do this as a base and then go over with a white to kind of get the part that I want. So like something like that maybe. That could kind of work, eh? Maybe I don't need to do a... But I really want to go translucent. I really want to go try translucent just to see it. Yeah. I really do. We might save that one. So I think at the moment, just to be safe and sorry, we'll we'll stick to what we're really com feeling confident on, um, and we'll do uh, our base card. We're gonna do our waves uh, or a splash. We'll do the manaphy, the frame. We'll make the base parts here. So you can see here, these are the the support struts that go underneath. So we've got little, three little support struts under the, they're gonna come along the base of the card here. Uh, and then we're gonna have the stuff, we just have to think very carefully before we actually do it. Um, the parts that are gonna hold the manaphy uh, up from the card itself and that the translucent kind of, um, the wisps are going to come out from that. So we're going to try get them coming across this way and this way up here, which I think should look quite effective. Yeah, I'm happy with that so far. All right, chat, so this is our combo. That's our core, core colors for this evening. We'll start adding, we'll start going, getting into it, so. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Uh, I'll put in 
that one to the side for when I need it. You're getting 120 frames per second, or D testing out his new uh, graphics processor. Very nice. Very envious, actually. So I'm just going to mark out my border. All right. Oh, that's where I put my pencils. Just out of my reach. I can't wait to rearrange my desk so I can actually get everything in the places that I want. from not being able to play yeah I can imagine it's um, to have uh, everything running at the speed that you want and to be able to do the games and play the stuff that you want to play um, yeah, it would be fantastic I think if I was a gamer I'd be more worried about it I think you know Like I don't, I don't play the the graphics hungry games, so I tend not to be as worried about things. Um, my one actually is, I just want to have one that's streams nicely and streams at a good quality, and that the picture and the sound looks good. And that's kind of kind of what I'm after. All right, so we should have this one nicely and a one centimeter border right round just like that hmm yeah just want to make sure that I get just not too uh, kind of I don't want to chop away too much I really want to keep maintain a lot of this um, this side of things, but I do want to get that flow. So um, if the manifest things are going to go kind of curl, they're going to curl down here and up. I kind of need to echo that that curve going along here, and then have something to kind of uh, keep the shape up here. actually go I can go maybe I can just do it like a giant s kind of more of an s shape so from here to here so I'll just move this one over middle part thinner here yeah I think this is kind of oh yeah this is kind of working for me so thin Me. 
then we'll just kind of do a little cutaway in here. I don't, I don't need it to be um, per, like um, not, perfect's not the word that I'm looking for. I don't need it to mirror. Tonight, um, it was good because uh, I enjoy umpiring. Hey, it was that's so cool getting into that that you're into that one. It's kind of heading down that track that you want to head down, isn't it, Cam? You know, with the the whole coaching deal. Um, um, it's just uh, it's very cool that you are, you know, just taking those steps. All right. Very, very proud of that. All right. Yeah, this is looking the part now. So we go here. Okay. What's the um, the hardest part of umpiring, Cam? What is the hardest thing that you're finding with um, when umpiring? through here because I don't want it to get too thin that it's um, going to be weak. having to think fast about whether it was contact or something yeah yeah that would be hard wouldn't it just kind of that that's that stuff that has to be a decision has to be made in the split kind of time i always found it interesting about why like different uh umpires and their mentalities around stuff like that like some um they were very hair trigger you know like if they saw anything that kind of looked like it boom you were you were taken for it but like it's that whole part of of finding the part that you feel is kind of consistent for you maybe I, i'm not going to do that I, I think i'm just going to keep these going out here yeah yeah all right i, don't, I think i'm getting too fancy i'm just going to do little embellishments here and here and I think that that should be enough with the embellishment. Really. Yeah. I want to keep it relatively simple.
uh, I let a few less obvious things slide, but I called up stepping a lot. I really think, and also probably like at the beginning of the season for netball, especially, like picking up stuff like um, stepping is 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 a really is, it, that's a good thing um, for most teams, you know, like it is a naturally um, yeah, not many people are gonna call you. Uh, you know, if you're going to be very harsh on stepping, there's very few that would actually kind of be a bit, you know, aggro about it. That's cool. Um, because it's um, it's only it's it's not only, um, it's grading games, isn't it? That, that's what everyone's doing at the moment, grading games. stepping and dragging their feet a lot and obstruction ah yeah there we go yeah that's all good solid beginning of the season kind of um you know things that all uh good things to pick up on really right at that beginning of the season you know probably coaches would thank you for it actually you know because um it's fundamentals isn't it Fundamentals of the game of netball. I'm actually going to try get myself along um, to one of the... Um, is it the ANZ Championship? Is that the, is that the, 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 the top championship thing? I want to get along to, um, to one of those games in the, the next short while. So I just realized I hadn't hadn't actually been along. So for those of you uh, in New Zealand, we have a, a netball is uh, generally a um, woman's sport. Um, but we're quite lucky at my school. We have uh, a good percentage of boys that play the game as well. And they just add a different kind of dynamic to it. But the professional uh, league in New Zealand is called the ANZ Championship, I think it is. And um, yeah, uh, one of the one of the teams is quite local to me, and so they just I'm kind of keen to go along and support them. Yeah, this is looking good. I'm happy with us. The, the, the Manaphy one just kind of popped out. It's quite cool. Right. It's not one that I naturally would have selected myself, you know. I'm really enjoying reading the kind of the packs of cards to kind of guide what I want to do. It's, um, it's interesting, it kind of randomizes. Um, randomizes and brings up kind of cards that I uh, am not aware of. Oh yeah, I'm happy with that. Where are you, Manaphy? I have too much uh, netball things on in the weeks. Yeah, that's I tell you. Yeah, that, that's that's one thing that you'll get. You'll get plenty of um, plenty of offers to do stuff, Cam. 
How do we reckon, chat? Is that looking the part? I'm liking this. I am liking where we're going. Gonna keep those just in case I need them for some rescues. All right. So, yeah, we'll be get that will get stuck down. We'll do a fold down the middle. Um, what is the best way to do this one? That's my question. If I give it time to dry, I, the glue sticks will do the job. I just find them very messy. Because once I've done, yeah, if I do the, if I glue it down, then that's going to go nicely there. Yeah. That's the part. Get that part down because then that'll help us with the, the next step. Training on Monday, umpiring Wednesday, nieces games Thursday, training Friday, and game Saturday. Yeah, that's a that's a fairly fairly hectic schedule on that one, Cam. Just saw this thing. Don't know if this is gonna work. Do it on a corner. Do it on a corner. It's not gonna show up here. But does it show up there? It's too light. Too light. I've heard rumors that there are stained glass pens that you can get from certain craft shops in New Zealand. I'm wondering whether I need to go have a look at that. Cause this, yeah, like that's just a highlighter chat. That could work. I reckon I'll look at those, yeah, I might go have a look at those pens. Because if I can do a this over the top, I can make that lifted layer. Yeah. That will work. That'll work. Alright. All right. Just don't want to have to do it on my nice on the side that I'm using for everything else. Learned that lesson. At least I don't have school tomorrow. I've heard that. Is there? There's a few schools having. Is this some? Um, are you having a teacher-only day tomorrow, Cam? I think that's going to hold. 
but we'll give that a day to cure. That's why I'm kind of why I didn't want to finish off everything today. So this will cure, and that's going to be our base. It's kind of fab. Yeah. All right. So, do I want to do the mana fee today? My problem with doing the mana fee today is I really don't want to lose it. <laughs> Like I did half an hour before the stream. Um, so, yeah, I'd like to maybe keep this, but we will do the, the backing. Um, we're only going to bring this up around about a centimeter off the main page. And then the Manaphy itself is going to be about another centimeter above that. So we're going to do three... Uh, um, pillars underneath the card so we'll make those now um, and we'll do three kind of two centimeter pillars my day was great cam we did um, started off a little bit rough everyone was a little I don't know what it's you know how some mornings it was mufti day today actually that's always what makes certain days rough so um, we had mufti day and um yeah students from those days are always a little bit on kind of you know wearing clothes that they want to wear clothes and attitude tends to go kind of with that kind of thing so um but by the afternoon everyone had kind of settled and were you know comfortable and at ease in what they were wearing so um yeah, we had a, a good afternoon so uh, normally we have a half, um, Wednesdays are my kind of half day, it's my, my time when I can go and get things done, but we actually did a full day today, because um, tomorrow we have uh, some musicians coming into school and they're going to be doing a performance, so that should be fun. Alright chat, that's that one, we're good. Alright, so there's our mock-up. Here's what it's going to look like. I've just really, just simplified down that design. I'm really happy. I really like the neutrals. Really like it that we've got the little watermark kind of peeking out here in the corner. Um, yeah, so now we're going to do the the little um, banner, uh, the little um, support structures underneath here. Build them so that they're ready. Uh, we'll do the card and... Yeah, I really want to let this glue cure properly overnight before I do any folding and sticking on it. Um, yeah, I just don't, don't want it to lift, uh, which this kind of glue has a tendency to do. So, um, yeah, we'll, we'll let that do its curing. We'll get these parts done. We'll do the Manaphy bit. We will finish on that one. I will. I have an envelope. I will put all of my little parts in, and that will be the, what we'll finish on today because that's an hour into the stream we'll um kind of do a pause do a little bit of a reset and um we might open a card we'll open up a um a pack and we'll uh let uh, the cards kind of guide what we're going to do so um yeah i like that i'm very very happy with where we're heading i'm wondering even if i can um at the moment is a real big problem with actually getting the colors that I want. So, um, but what I'd love is maybe something that is a dark blue that I can kind of edge this in. So I could edge around here and edge under here just to provide a little bit of a, like a contrasting loop. So I'm going to, um, I'll have a look for that overnight and just see if I can add that to it. But that's going well. This is looking the part, chat. So, let's do the Manaphy. And we'll go from there. Trying to make sure I don't have any more of that glue left on my uh, 
lift on my hands. Hey, click on that person and bam, boom, X, nice. It's not self-promotion, that's a bot. That's a bot, D. We don't worry about bots. Get out of here. Yep. In fact, D, while you're around, Who created it, mister? Some person. Some person that wants to... They, the bots troll the stuff all the time. Like, there's amazing. I, I had one streamer that I was following. Yeah, the people trying to promote. You know, like... They... Well, they... A lot of people buy those bots. Do you know what I mean? Like, so they buy those bots to use it. That then go out and do stuff. So... Um, and I know Twitch actually apparently has done a real big job of removing a whole lot of uh, bot accounts. Um, but they had one streamer that I was watching the other day and he had like, he got hit by like 300 bots all at once. Um, I have seen streamers being able to combat a lot of that by like switching their one into emote mode. So um, unfortunately for us, that would uh, that would mean all of, all of, like three available emotes or something for people um but emote mode uh, that you know like well that we three emotes of ours but um yeah often they use that kind of stuff to get around um any bot attacks that they may get so all right let's cut out the mana fee So we're going to be using the card as a frame um, for the final pop-up. No stress, Ezekiel. I, I, I have the power. Like, um, you know. I'm a big boy and I can handle the band button myself. All right. Let's pop this one out. Come on, Manaphy, give us the pop. Yep, that's what I want. There we go. That's a good pop. Oh, no, no, it's not a good pop. That was not a good pop. Does not need to fret whatsoever. I find that if I hold this up here, it actually gives me a really good indication of bits that I need to fix up. Ooh, go that way. I'm so used to doing it upside down. For those like who weren't um, when I did the pop-ups, uh, I did all of the work that I did for the pop-ups in my teaching class upside down. All right, I did them like, did them like this, so that the people, when when it was projected onto my screen, that what um, actually on the TV was the right way up, because there was no setting, there's no standard setting in um, on the computer to flip the, the the actual webcam itself over. So I spent an entire year doing it. Very difficult. And then I get onto Twitch Studio, which is what I use for this. And there's a very handy flip vertical, flip horizontal. Wonderful. There we go. All right, don't need to turn it over. 
That's our mana fee one. I'm just gonna go grab an envelope. in there so we do not lose it all right so now we'll do the mana fee now the one this one here in particular we have to uh, my phone just cracked more oh no cam so for the mana fee we just have to be really careful around just where the things join here uh, and down here the arms particular so really want to be careful with those that's where I feel that if we can glue it onto the plastic um, it's just gonna keep the manaphy from like bending more um, so yeah we shall see so tonight chat I'm actually experimenting with a, a, a double light setup on my cards so I've got, a, I've got lighting on the left and the right tonight definitely noticing the difference I don't know if that's made a difference for everybody else kind of watching but I'm noticing the difference for myself Still not in the positions that I would really want them to be. I want them to be up a little bit higher. But we are getting there, chat. More professional by the minute. Tentacles? Feelers? Are difficult. with my cutting chat. these little stumpy legs all right just need to be a little bit careful around here yeah cute come on give me a little pop pop under that arm there we go all right So 
so work our way around. Nice. Baubles at the end of the antenna. Done. Come on, be kind. Be kind. There we go. All right. Oh, nice. This is kind of like, just pretty much like our relief kind of art that we do. And then we're going to just take it to that next level with our pop ups. Alright. Let's look in the part chat. Let's get that card back actually. So, this is what we're going to look like. So we're going there. That will be centered like that, that will be up off the page, all right, by about a centimeter, okay, by about a centimeter, and Manaphy is just going to be just chilling kind of to the side here, um, it'll be to the right of the, the divide here in the card, so he's just going to be just floating a little bit there. Quite happy with that, eh? Let's look in the part. Very liking, much liking that one. And again, remember this is a pop-up, so it will actually, so it's, the whole card is gonna do it. All good, D. So that's what we're gonna be looking like. I'll just put it there. I always don't like putting them down, it makes it just look, you know, like it's a flat poster. But we're gonna really, yeah, it will come forward off that card. In fact, can I lift that up a bit? There we go. Yeah, that's starting to look nice, I like that. In fact, I could do little teardrop bits there little teardrop here just to add a bit of interest yeah that would work all right I'm liking so now we'll do the support struts which will go hiding underneath uh, okay we can just use there's a reason why we keep these bits don't we chat yeah let's do these so we'll use these underneath um, nothing goes to waste. Catch you, Ezekiel. Have a good night, mate. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you can join us tomorrow when we finish this one. Finish this one off. It'd be fantastic. All right. There we go. So, now we're going to do um, three... Um, one centimeter supports and we'll do three uh, two centimeter supports so two centimeter and two centimeter two centimeter so we're leaving um, basically it's going a centimeter for tape centimeter and then two centimeters for tape and that's kind of how we're just repeating that one there nice that's them and then just nice one centimeter ones just for underneath the card itself. 
So one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay. So those are our three ones. Study. God evening to you too, study boy. God evening. How are you, matey? How's your day been? Thank you again for the far out 100 biddies. <laughs> you know, we can never not let an opportunity to m remark on someone's accidental typing. Are you typing on your keyboard at, um, from a computer or are you on your phone, study boy? Alright, let's get some little bits of tape going. Amazing how many quickly people are so easy, quick on to jump on to, uh, you know, small spelling errors that people have or something. It's quite bizarre. All right. So we're just going to put just a little bit of tape on each of these. To kind of get things prepped. And these will be ready for us to add, add our next layer on. What have you been up to uh, up to today, study boy? Oh, it was your Wednesday. Uh, well, it was shitty really, but staff meeting tonight. Got in a pop. Oh, dude. Oh, that sucks that today was a rubbish day for you. Sorry to hear that, man. You were at work today. Oh. Hold on, am I got the wrong day? Isn't Wednesday normally... You're kind of chill, like, well, not chill day, but you know, doing other things day. Yeah, I type on my keyboard. Oh, you are on your keyboard, you're on your laptop. All right. Um, oh man, that sucks. I am... Um, I hope that the uh, you felt that the apology was sincere and mean and meaningful for you, because that does suck. Normally I'm off Wednesday. Okay, I had that right in my head. Yeah, they meant it. Nice. That's good. I don't know. I like it when people can, you know, I don't know. We're all guilty of it, aren't we? Like, occasionally we will just let the tongue go faster than our, our brain. 
the ability to actually apologize is a big one. Uh, you're here. I woke up like an hour ago. Wow. Hey, all good hyphen. How are you doing, mister? It was very interesting. Actually, after you're giving me the information, um, there was uh, a lot of students who are uh, celebrating uh, Eid. Uh, and were very impressed by my understanding and knowledge of it, and even the fact that I knew that there was an event at Eden Park. They were quite impressed. So thank you very much for the, the education that you continue to be for me. Oh my gosh well it's definitely yours i haven't had a i have no frame drops i have some slow frames but that's just me um on my wi-fi well actually it's not my wi-fi it's definitely my what i'm streaming using that's on the agenda for picking up as we go all right chat so there we go we've got our three little um two centimeter ones out and our three one centimeters we're going to be putting those these three smaller ones will go underneath our manaphy card lifting it just off the page the two centimeters will hold the manaphy uh, and will support the the translucent swirls i love the description of the stream i'm i i have to say i'm really pleased like i didn't even google that like, I didn't even have to Google. That was just off the top of my head. I was like, I'm doing Manaphy. It was good. You got it. See? You got it. Got it in one. I'm no, very pleased with that one. All right. I think these three bits are good to go. So, like I said, chat, I, I, I'm really not happy with the pink that I've got. I'm really not happy with the effect that I'm getting at the moment. I have heard about these, uh, a little bit of stand up, absolutely. What's the deal with airplane food? Um, the, um, I wanna get, use the make, uh, I wanna see if I can get these, um, I've heard about these kind of like uh, stained glass pens that you can get that can go onto glass. I think that they will work um, really well on the plastic. Um, I have found Eid. I have found Eid. Had to find out about it. Haven't found a lot of teachers or parents willing to share or teach me. Yeah, it's interesting, eh? Because what what's more in the community that you're like? What the families? Do you have a lot of Muslim, um, like Muslim children in your at your work? Google is not the best. No. Well, they're actually, there's, there's not some bad ones. I found several that um, really were helpful for me. Some families. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just kind of, yeah, I just, I've, I'm, I've, I've been very fortunate. I've had um, a lot of different students that have been part of my education. Um, so I've had uh, a lot of uh, Muslim children from lots of different nationalities um, and uh, uh, some fantastic Hindi um, in fact we were talking about today and there was my kids you know that were Jehovah's Witness kids so it was just it was good to be able to be able to talk about it and yeah with and hear their um, hear their perspectives and just learn from them which is really really cool all right chat so this is this is good this is what we've got so oh hyphen you would have missed this so this was our draft if you remember this was our draft that we made all right so that was our draft one and so we selected found some really nice i'm really happy with the textures that we've got here got a nice simple contrast with this yeah nice eh um we've cut out 
the Manaphy card. So that's ready to roll. We've got the borders and we have the little Manaphy. Ooh, it's hiding. Where are you, Manaphy? There you are, in my envelope. Smart idea using an envelope. And so that's kind of the effect that we're gonna go for, but it's gonna be lifted like that. So there you go, study boy and, and hyphen. So Manaphy is gonna be two centimeters up. The card is gonna be a centimeter off, all right? And we'll get the plastic at that two centimeter level as well. So yeah. And so the plastic will kind of um, layer will be around here and we'll kind of follow um, a bit of the wave motion is what I wanted because that kind of is like what we've got on the little card that we drew here. Well, not that we, we drew, that we got out of our one. So I think we're heading in the right, ch the right way. Really pleased with this. Don't you think? So I think we're gonna get, so I've got the plastic, we'll get, I'm gonna pop in and get myself those uh, stained glass pens because I think I'll be able to get, by the look of it, like we've just got, it's it's white with a kind of a, an edging of pink. So it's white with the edging of pink. Just to, and, our, and if we get the white with the edging of pink, if we can get as close to that as possible, it would look amazing. My goodness, I wonder if Twink, do you remember, uh, not many people have it, it's the whiteout or the twink pens. I wonder if that would work. It would look, uh, nah, actually, uh, no, twink pen would be awful because eventually it would start to crack. That's one thing about twink pens, they did, always did crack. Yeah, we have many of those, yeah, yeah. It's not, it's not a thing you find these days, whiteout and twink pen. Yeah, it would, the, 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 the plastic would move and it would start it yeah and it picks up everything around it so we'll steer away from that i think we'll have a look see if there's a white i'm going to see if there's a white one uh and a pink and so we'll we'll do that and that'll create a nice translucent layer above here and then i'm also going to look for some dark blue just to i just feel like this needs a little bit of a just a little bit of reinforcing um uh, just a you know just to reinforce that curve and then that will just i think then i'm I'll, I'll be a happy man on that one get some white markers like white sharpies for people's signatures hey actually yeah not i like that idea I, i'll i think we'll get a couple we'll just see kind of what's in stock and um we'll give it a try you know like that's the whole idea of this channel is to experiment and actually have a go so this is a good one. I'm, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with where we're heading. I'm going to put these in here. Um, you guys missed the part where I had an almost heart attack when I um, was about to start the stream and could not find the Manaphy card at all. Could not find it. I did manage to find it uh, with my um, my folder of my, my good card. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So we did find it. We did find it, it was hiding, and yeah, but there we go. So that, chat, is we're gonna put this to the side now, um, and I think we're gonna do a pack opening, all right? Because I've I've done what I wanted to do on that one. I'm gonna run an ad, gonna come back with a pack opening. Uh, with the After the pack opening, what we're gonna do is, yeah, we'll let the pack guide what we're gonna do, all right? This is what we do um, with our ones. We'll do something uh, nice and easy, um and it's a good way to finish off our wednesday stream so i'm going to click over here i am going to hit a run a one minute ad i know that that doesn't work for everybody but we will run that and uh, see how we go so be back in a sec
all of 10 seconds remaining for the thousands and the millions and millions watching around the world. There we go. There's my end of my ad. Oh no, 10 seconds, nine, eight, sevens. Slowly coming back. Not sure. If you saw an ad, let me know. I clicked the button. That was a good break. And I had a drink, which was always a good thing to me to do. So we're going to open up a packet of battle styles. And it's going to guide what we're going to do. So normally the three that we look at, chat, um, with the time that we've got, we've got half an hour. So we might be able to squeeze, probably just only be able to do one. So... Um, We'll have a look. The ones that we normally look at are the, the energy type. Uh, we look at the reverse hollow and we look at the rear. Yeah, yeah. So we've got the, oh, the T-Tar Battle Styles one. So um, we'll open this one out and we're going to save uh, another one for the end of the stream. All right, so we'll do uh one actually let's open up both these packs not not open them open them but just actually have them ready to go all right so we've got uh the empoleon we've got the t-tar i would love to get the sleepy t-tar out of these ones that would be amazing um what do we feel like chat do we feel like the tyranitar do we feel like the empoleon what's the one that we should open to for our final make of the night what's going to be our which pack left right titar or empoleon type that in the chat tyranitar is a pretty cool dude i yeah it is a pretty cool one i met him he really nice i don't know if you kind of look at some of these pokemon don't you think study boys going left hyphen is going titar I think we're going this way. All right, let's do it. Let's do this one. You have a Mega and regular uh, Tyranitar EX. Oh, that's pretty cool. Have you seen the sleepy Tyran uh, the Tyranitar, the sleepy one? I really, I think, I just love the artwork on that one. Oh, it's not a hit chat, but that's all right. We don't mind. You do 60 damage for each damage counter on your opponent. Plus 250 damage. Oh, that's pretty... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty cool. I like the ones where it is... Um, you have to take that risk. Um, oh, hold on. For each dam 60 damage for each damage counter on your one. This, I think there's a similar deck that's going around at the moment, but I don't think it uses the Tyranitar itself. Um, I think it's a Spiritomb deck on TCG Online. So actually the stuff is reset, the ladder has reset. Yeah, 30 damage would equal 100, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, nothing would, if anything was 60 damage or more, uh, would be done. Actually, I played up against, uh, I've been playing the Tea Party deck on uh, TCG Online, and that's been fun. So just, uh, uh, maybe if, uh, yeah, maybe if we get, have some time at the end of this, maybe I'll... Uh, jump on TCG online at the end of this, but the Tea Party deck is kind of one of those ones you it does uh, 20 damage for each Pokemon that has Mad uh, or Tea Party in it, and it uh, if, if if it's in your discard pile, which really grows quickly, so it's got a mass of those Pokemon that you're trying to discard. One, two, a three, a four. Let's flip it around to the front. All right. Oh, it's so weird being able to look at my cards. All right, chat. I'm going to hold it there. It's a nice thing. All right. The steeliest of energy. Actually, it could be good. Let's put that one just there. The Op Shop Vase. <gasps> Spewper. Hey, Gliscor. Horsey. I still love this artwork on the horsey. Just so cute. I think this one is a pop-up, and if we can recreate that stream of water would be amazing. Grand's Mars Ashes. Wow. Wow. Don't want to find that in the op shop. Mankey. Marwile. 
Fomantis, Remoraid, ooh, hello, a Reverse Hollow Murkrow, that's our second one, and a, ooh, what do we got? A Fighting Type, Fighting Type. Conqueror. All right. So what have we got here? We got steel, uh, a fighting, and a dark type. Well, I feel like we've done a lot of fighting types recently, haven't we? Sheesh, man! Don't skip big day. That, <laughs> that is a man who skipped leg day. That is a man who skipped leg day. There we go. We've done a lot of uh, fighting ones recently, haven't we? The, the packs have been kind of guiding us down that path. But, like, it would be nice to do something, um, either the Steel or Darkness ones, I think, wouldn't it? Steel or Darkness? Why his nose look like, the Jolly like a Jolly Rancher? Wow, that's a that's a good reference for our American friends. Did you go for a Jolly Rancher? It does look like a jelly bean from this angle. He just has that really odd little dollop on his head. Little little dollop. It does look like a spinning top, doesn't it? Or a turnip. It does look like a turnip. A grape Jolly Rancher? Mmm. Artificial flavors. That's a bump because he was dropped as a child. Well. Wow. Mm. Alright. So there's our guidance for our final for our final relief for the evening. We'll put the Empoleon to the side. See if we can get something from that. Um what we got? What we got? Just see if there's any that's oh we could go down the idea of a uh, coughing I also have not here but I do have a different this was the cards that I opened uh, this is the champions path pack that we opened when we did uh, the little tin um, I do have a champions path coughing we could also do um, the Morpeko, the Dark Morpeko. One moment caller, I'm gonna go grab. Wow, we're really lacking. Ah, there he is, Morpeko. Do I have a second, please? Yes! Do I have a third? Just a second. All right, this is it. Well, you know, they're not expensive cards there, hyphen, by the way, as well. I do have, I have them, but, you know, mostly there's a lot of commons and uncommons. I don't, 
I don't have one of these uh, Instagrammable collections as yet. Really. My one is uh, very much on the, um, you know, it's on the modest side. It is on the modest side. I think that would be fair to say. Alright. I actually couldn't find any more coughings. I'm a little bit disappointed. Alright, I'm going to have to hit up somebody. He's got more cards than hairs on his chest. You have no idea how many hairs on my chest. At all. You have no idea. Oh, I got a... Right, I see. I got a lot of more Peko in this one. Oh, look at more Peko. More Peko, so cute. More Peko, so cute. I have the triple of that. I have a double. Oh no, I got a triple of that. With the shuckle in the background and the um, pick a pick. Is it pick a pick? There. D. Playing the walkie dead. Nice. From the swimming pool pick, you have zero hairs. You aren't looking that closely. Um, the swimming pool pick. My gosh. But that was like 40 years ago. Feels like it feels like it all right I really like um, the small Peko though all right let's see if we can do it yeah let's do the dark more Peko it's guiding us the pack is guiding us chat that is what we shall do that's what I feel will be nice right let's go 40 years ago I would be a lot younger I love the thing here hangry hangry tackle if you have no cards this attack does 90 more 110 for one energy well wow. that's a pretty good attack for a little card. All right. And I'm thinking, chat, that maybe some of these ones that I am doing, I might stick up on, uh, up on my Discord, and you know, if people are keen on them, they can. Uh, throw us an offer. I'm addicted to diamond paintings. I feel you are, Cam. It's not a bad addiction. Well, actually, no, hold on. Addiction by definition is never a good thing. Oh my gosh. Corners are not wanting to pop. Maybe I'm getting at the point where the blade does need a replace. All right. What's the uh, current diamond painting cam? What's the the one that you've been doing most recently. Addiction, bad, strong, love, ad ad addiction. Love equals bad. Is love an addiction? We're not talking Bon Jovi here. Love is bad medicine. Uh, I've started another big one. Are there ones that you go for, Cam? Like, are there particular pictures that, or do you just, it's a diamond picture, you'll just, you'll just get it. Where was I the other day? And they had a whole lot. They were like, they were like only like 10 bucks or something like that. Like, they were quite cheap. So we're going to try, chat. We'll see if we can 
get underneath our little Morpeko guy here. And in fact, we could probably just do this bit around. Then keep the green and our Morpeko to this. And then that comes into the foreground. And then this in the background here. Yeah, what's left over will cut through. Maybe that will work. Um, oh, hold on. Where are we go? It is an addiction. I mean, love is an addiction. It is just bad for you. For real, for real. I ain't talking from experience or nothing. Uh, so don't pull about how do you know Ab though. Sure, Abdo. It's all good. Uh, so, what? Hold on. So, whatever one has every bit included in the background, you have to fill up and go for those ones, if that makes sense. No, I know how they go. But what kind of ones really attract you? Like, what are they pictures of animals, flowers, all that kind of stuff? I don't, if that makes sense. Alright. Let's see if we can get these apples. How about these apples? Slip. Um, hey, this chat is just a bit confusing. It's very, it's anyone to be honest. Right, got you. Welcome to my world, Abdo. The world of confusing chats. When we started the stream, we had three different people singing three different songs in chat. Chat karaoke was going strong. sounds very depressing it's is less depressing than you think it is fantastic when it goes off hey what kind of ancient egyptian pharaoh music is this what is the name of this track hold on this track is called a line a line a line missing the point as well that probably in general most karaoke is depressing in real life align the slaves will build the pyramids what wow wow too soon too soon all right let's get our little more picko so we're going to go, hmm, 
We want to get these bright green parts. So I'm going to get... Okay, cut down here. Yeah, that should be good. ASMR killed the cam. Rip cam. Oh. I missed what cam said. Mister, you just made me jump and drop the gems absolutely everywhere. <laughs> Is cam. <laughs> Bravo. Bravo hyphen. For getting that prediction. Out so quick. Responsive, that's what we want from our moderators. Please keep doing my ASMR. Um, especially in these quiet times, if I can do ASMR just to help things along, sure. I almost did radio for a little bit. I almost did radio. I had an invite to do a like a radio test thing, but mm, I don't know. I, I don't know if I would have the temperament to be on radio. Oh, I'm so happy that we chose. Ah, uh, I'm so happy that we chose more Pico. This is great. More Pico is so cute. <laughs> it's kind of Yes and yes, 50%, both ways. Um, it's 50%, we should investigate, 100%. Mister, this is not funny, it went all down, all in the painting, and I can't get rid of it. Uh, I wasn't loud. I'm sorry that my voice made you jump. I will not try to do that for a little while. Or will I? Gotta get rid of it, Mister. You no, it's nice. Just sudden reverb uh, and uh, mic noise. Uh, Cam died again. Oh my God! Stop it! You made me do it again. What did I do, Cam? <laughs> hey, um, good luck with the lessons, hyphen. Um, thanks, mate, for hanging out. Um, We'll be opening one pack to end our stream in a little bit, but yeah, we're gonna. I um, hope you can make it back for. Ah, uh, oh, yeah. Oh well. Well, definitely got to look your best for Eid. So we probably won't see you tomorrow. You probably won't see you tomorrow. Um, we're gonna be finishing off our Manaphy card tomorrow live on stream. Now that all the bits, we're just needing the glue to go set on that stuff so that it's all good. So um, yeah, hyphen. Uh, if you when you get a chance, uh, when you can get yourself back on stream on online, um, keen to show you uh, what the Manaphy card and how it turned out. All right. Let's see if we can get this Apple Core chat. 
let's see if we can get the apple core. Just gotta be careful with my lines. It's gonna be a little bit. It's not gonna be as kind of accurate as we normally have to be. We just have to give it a little bit more space, I feel. And we're gonna have to do like a like a quarter of a square to kind of lift this one, but you know. I think it's going to be worth the effort. You're simply annoying, mister. Absolutely. Yeah, I will. Put it on the Discord. Check it out. Awesome. Hope he goes well. And the haircut looks amazing. I always have a problem with haircuts. I always find that... I need... I need normally, like... Well, it depends on the hairdresser that I go to. I have a... A very a couple of ones that I very much like going to when I can get to those and but some of them I just need like a day my hair needs like a day or two to recover after I've been to a hairdresser it never kind of looks good coming out of the hairdresser and then you know yeah needs to grow out a bit after I've been somehow they they can comb it and make it do all the things that it's meant to in the shop. Don't know if other people find this. Cam, you should know be my now. Annoying is my middle name. Okay. Got the parts for the Mopeco. Look in the part there and there. Just want to get um, hmm. I think we might just go across the hedging here. Kind of like the angle a bit better on this one. That'll just look kind of cooler, having that level. Yeah. Done. Uh, I need to get it, my hair cut more than three to four times a year. I, I study boy, I am kind of in a similar... Um, and you know what, actually, the one that I... My hair probably is just, it just needs a trim, like I've got the curly, curly, curly hair. And it's just more the part that I have to maintain, it's more the beard, like maintaining the beard. Like I think if I, my, my hair can go curly as, and it doesn't look bad, but um, my beard, if I don't maintain that, that's when it really starts to look scrappy, really starts to look scrappy. All right. So let's see chat, let's, um, we'll set up our stuff as normal and then we will see if we can get this apple and all those kind of things um, stuck on. Yeah, you do get a bit of the mop, don't you? Get it going as well. You do get a good mop going when you, when you want to, study boy. this work? Hmm. Doesn't quite work. I think we're going to need to do an eighth. So, I'm sorry, a half. I'm going to go down to a quarter. I don't know if this is going to work, but we shall see, chat. I'll see. Uh, last time I went to the hairdresser, they cut my hair too short. I was very annoyed. Yeah. Is it the thing that you... 
do you guys like is it the thing where you realize oh my god they're doing it wrong they're doing it wrong or is it that you only realize it at the end when my hair is short i don't get the curl yeah i'm I, I'm, I'm the same kind of way embrace the curl there yeah, study boy embrace the curl i say Curl is good. All right, can I get this one off? So like when it was going bad, Cam, like when did you know it was going wrong? Like the last time I went to the hairdressers, I got my beard trimmed and the person that did my trim started to cut, um, the beard line um, with the cheek it kind of gave me a dip around the goatee kind of always making a goatee and then sideburns type look and um, yeah I was kind of like ah before um, I could actually pause them really oh that looks so cool oh I'm happy with that all right um, oh, what did Cam say here? He cut it on one side, and I was like, oh my god, no, and then he cut it long, like a long bob, and I simply wanted to punch him. Oh no. Yay, evil. Hey, Podgy Panda! How are we, mate? Oh, the Pancham. Nice. Oh, can I do it here? Let's see if I can be flash. Have I got shout out? Podgy. There we go. Boom. Oh no, mate. Kid's sick. What is it? Um Is it the same stuff? Is it colds or is it something else this time? No school, f yeah, it seems like there's a quite a few, because uh, there's a few college that are having the uh, teacher only day tomorrow there, D. A few college people are having that one. Um, yeah, just really, so, uh, I tell you when, especially when the littlies get the, 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 the kind of the block nose and stuff and they're having kind of troubles with that, that's just, oh, it's the heartbreaking thing been waking up in the night so haven't been able to stream ah oh, mate oh, I really hope that um, Chester is on the up soon because yeah it's a hard life we've got um, one of my teaching friends has twin girls and um, unfortunately they got a gastro bug and if you think it's bad having one child with gastro, imagine having twins. Twins with gastro bugs. Not fun whatsoever. So, um, have you uh, managed to catch said Pancham as yet on your one? Well, I hear about uh, twins getting sick all the time from my mother-in-law. Oh, really? <laughs> um, I don't have kids, but I woke up this 3 a.m. this morning with back pain. Uh, oh, they're in tier one. Oh, I, I, I tell you, I've been, I have to admit, I've been slack with my pogo. Um... I did get, I saw your stash of uh, shiny morels. I got two in that one. Um, yeah. Study boy, I have just constant back pain. Oh my god. <laughs> Not so cool, bro. Oh, poor things. Actually, I get my one, I get like, I get a back thing every two or three. No, no. Like two or three times a year is when I really get it. 10 morels on that day is kind of nuts. Another streamer I know got 12. Wow. I'm happy with my couple. I'm not I'm not a greedy man. A couple is good. A couple is nice. So. 
I um, always find it hard. Um, Re-add each other. Oh yeah. I'm in. Um, I had to get up and walk around. I always have a lot of back pain. Oh man. Cam is uh, an elderly person before her time. But I had to get up and walk around. Yeah. I have a really good Cairo. Sorry, that was part of the story I was saying before I, I, I kind of, my train of thought got interrupted. Um, so I have a very good chiropractor. Um, I'm not a massive person for the crack, crack part of it, but every time that I've gone to my Cairo, um, within two sessions, I'm, I'm back kind of in to what I need to be. So, because I've had ones where it's just been debilitating. Um, well, I'm sorry I fractured my back. Oh, Cam. The fracturing the back. There's going to be something that you'll do something to yourself some way. I just have to speak nicely into the microphone. And you're going to fall over and hit the wall or something. Oh, I'm very happy with getting little more peco there yeah that's cool i'm happy with that all right let's double them up and get this one see look what did you break what did you break when i did that um podgy uh what's the best way message me uh your number we'll i'll add you back in on the I, th I think, are we? Yeah. Um, I need to just get myself out and do some more walks. Because that was what Pogo was always good for me, just to get it, get myself out and walk. So I'm starting to, I've adjusted my schedule, um, life schedule, really. And um, kind of just trying to allow a bit more time to do some other things. I need to go now. Uh, we need to talk soon. Yeah, man. Um, we've definitely got our... Yeah. Fire us a message. Because super keen just to have a... Have a chat. Because it's been way, 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 way too long. Need to get full updates on everything. Full updates. My back was that bad once. I couldn't feel my leg and couldn't walk. Yeah. That's pretty darn full on. It is allowing your body enough time to stop and rest though. That's well, one thing I think a lot of us need to do. Stop and rest and allow it to heal. Hmm. Where are my long strips? Long strips, where did you go? gonna have to let's do some of these and cut them in half done so excited to finish off this Manaphy one tomorrow so yeah, we will be streaming chat um, tomorrow. Oh, I've cut too many pieces. Oh well, that's all right. Um, we'll be streaming tomorrow from um, seven, and uh, we'll be finishing off our Manaphy pop up for the week, um, which I'm really excited to see that one done. Um, it'll give me time to pop to the local stationist and get those things that I th I'd be happier having, and probably means that I'll be investing. A large amount in 
other types of paper. Because I can see myself doing that. I think I traumatized my niece the other night and I feel bad. That sounds like you're doing the job of an auntie. How did you traumatize your niece? There, Cam. How did you traumatize her? I think I can blame cousins for lots of most of my trauma. More than my aunties and uncles. My eldest, one of my older cousins was the reason that I just very much disliked things like vampires and all those things because was able to freak me out with those things when I was a, a very much a younger kid. All right, there we go. All right, Mopeko, little dark Mopeko. Let's put your cover on. Perfect. Excellent. Oh, that one's there. She was trying to sleep and she was laying next to me and I was watching Zodiac and she wouldn't. Oh my God. Ah, yes. Yeah. Um, oh my God, Cam. Choosing appropriate TV with children around. Yeah, big one. But don't worry, everyone's done that. Everyone has watched some kind of program that a kid's walked in on. And, yeah. How's that looking? Ah, oh, don't need to do it upside down anymore. I'm so used to doing it upside down. There we go, chat. A cool little Morpeko. I'm happy with that guy. He's so cute. I thought she was asleep. Yeah, that's what kids do. They wake up. Ah, uh, now she's scared of the dark. Oh, it does pass. I, I had one the other day, and my son now is 10 years old, and we played a movie. It was just it was Jurassic Park, um, and this was a, a few years ago now, but played Jurassic World, I think it was, and that just was horrifying to him. He just did not like that one whatsoever, so... And that did had, end up being a few sleepless nights, but, you know, it... It changes. They get over. There we go, chat. A cool little Morpeko. Throwing away the little apple core. I love that one. Quite happy with that. I would have been happy with why maybe one more card. He's cute. All right. So we're ready, chat. That's going to be uh, where we're going to end our stream to the night. Um, we've got... Our card, more Peko there. We've got our Manaphy stuff drying. The glue's drying, ready to go. We've got our stuff for our Manaphy card stored away nicely in our little envelope. Well, our mock, I think we've definitely lifted the level um, from our mock. We've definitely made it a little bit more professional. Um, so I'm really excited to see how this one's going to end up. Um, all right. Let's see if we can end our stream on a little bit of a bang. We're going to open up our Empoleon pack. Uh, and then I think we shall end our stream. So, um, yeah, this one's going to close off our night chat. Thank you very much for uh, all of your wonderful support. We have... Um, we will finish off that Manaphy deck tomorrow night. So, um, yeah, please join us again when we're going to do this one. And and kind of uh, complete that one. I think it's it's looking amazing. It's really looking the part that I'm I'm happy with. Um, I can't wait to actually see this one completed. So let's open this one and see what we can get. Oh, not a. We are just not having the hits in in terms of percentages. Not having the hits. One, two, three, four. Flip it around. 
All right. Here we go, chat. Let's see. Get something. Fighting energy. The Cedra. Weeping Bell. Experience Share. The Murkrow. Horsey. Cherubi. The Licky Tongue. Woo. My youngest will be pleased with that. Electa Buzz. Ooh, hello. Reverse Hollow Sizzlepeed. I think I have one of these already. And, uh. Wow. Wow. Conkledur is our new grandpa chat. Conkledur is our new grandpa. Excellent. Well, I'm not letting the cards disappoint me. I'm really enjoying like what we've done tonight, chat. We've got the more Peko. If you're interested in seeing, uh, having something done for you, jump on our Discord. Um, we'll do card art for any cards that you like. We've got two extremely exciting projects coming up. I am just waiting on the delivery of those cards. Uh, I can't wait to show you what we've got and to do those live on stream. Um, we'll finish off the mana fee tomorrow. We'll open some more packs to end our week. And hopefully tomorrow we will have our very cool announcement uh, for you all. So um, yeah, I look forward to be able to make that one uh, and show you guys uh, all of that stuff tomorrow. So thank you very much for your support. Cam, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for everybody else for your um, uh, very lovely support. We shall see you uh, in 24 hours time. 22, won't it? There we go. Good night.